Hey guys, how are you? Um, I got a new wig and I got this off of eBay. This is the Claire from um, Noriko and it's in the Creamy Toffee R and I bought this, I believe it was $59.50 um, and when I purchased it, I got a, a message from the seller. Her name is Karen, and she said that she watches my videos on YouTube, and she thought that this would look really good. And I have to agree. Um, it is, I'd say, a medium length. This might need to be trimmed a little bit. Um, it just is kind of funky, this one little piece there, but I don't know. I'll have to wear it and see how it goes. Uh, but this is Claire. It's an older wig. She said that the color just didn't work for her, but I really like this. This has the regular cap. It's not a monotop. It's the regular cap. It's rooted, and as with all of the Noriko wigs, it has lots and lots of permatease and volume, and here you go, denim. There's a little Joan tuck. So, yeah, let's do the little spin around so you can see. And this is my top from Sam's Club, and I got it in the black, it's the same pattern in the black. It's about $15. So that is my Claire. Uh, my Noriko Claire from Karen on eBay. So thank you, Karen. I really do like it. The only thing is this one funky little piece here actually seems longer than the other side, and I have it on. The ear tabs are right here, so I may need to trim this one just a, a tad bit, but I really like it. And um, I'm a little more dressed up today because I want to give you just a quick little life update, moving update. Oh, and it came in the box. So, very nice. Um, I'll put her store below and mine, of course, because I have all sorts of fabulous things that you guys are going to want to buy. Anyway, so... We were planning on moving to Las Vegas, well, for me, but we were planning on flying down like July 31st, August 1st, around there. But the problem has been the dogs. Apparently all the airlines have embargoes during the summer so you can't fly animals unless they're in the cabin because I'm sure they've been sued by people um, because of high temperatures. So at first we thought, well, maybe we can fly into Salt Lake and then get a rental and drive down to Las Vegas. But we found out that everyone has an embargo during the summer. So we're going to have to drive, which is okay. Mike figures it will take about six days with so 10 hours of driving. I'm not really looking forward to it. I'm not someone who enjoys um, long road trips. But the plan is we're going to go look at a um, Chrysler Town and Country minivan. We've had one in the past. We had a 97. I just love that thing. But I forgot what Mike called it. But this one, the seats actually go down into the floor, I guess. And he thinks we're going to bring two big dog crates and a small one for Emmy for the dogs. And I'm like, I don't think we're going to have room for that and a suitcase or two. But... I'm not going to argue with them. We'll just have to get the minivan and um, see. We wanted to get an SUV or a bigger vehicle to have in Las Vegas. So, um, and we're friends with um, the guy who is a co-owner of the Jeans Chrysler here in town. And so I think Mike is going to talk to him about trading in his vehicle, although it's you know, 12 years old, so I don't know how good that's going to be, but, um, and then he will just keep my Equinox, and we'll just drive down, and then he'll fly back, uh, so we're going to go, today we're going to go, the reason that I'm all fancy, <laughs> this is fancy for Fairbanks, um, is because we're going to go get our passport pictures taken, 
and I'll just wear my um, my Noriko Berlin, my topper that I usually wear because that's what I'll probably be wearing on the trip down and to have my passport picture look like I do right now is probably a good thing. Um, so we're going to go get our passport pictures taken, get our passports, apply for them at the post office, um, go look at the minivan. We're going to have to return the giant dog crate that we bought um, because we're not going to use it now. And who knew it would... Mike spent hours and hours on this trying to figure out how to get us to fly us down to Vegas or down to the lower 48 so we could drive and it's just a no-go, so... Anyway, be ready for some road trip um, videos. <laughs> so the packing and purging is going very well. We've gotten rid of tons of stuff. The garage is filling up with things that we're going to take. We have the, um, the construction or the contractor guy coming on Saturday. He's going to come through and do measurements and give us an estimate for painting and flooring we have to go look at flooring for here the tiles i picked out for the house in vegas that we're going to eventually move into the contractor guy in vegas said that they were terrible so we have to go look and see what we can get in the um allure uh what's it called I'm having another alzheimer moment traffic master allure I already had the planks picked out that I wanted for the rest of the house. So we may um, go with ceramic tile for the kitchen area and the bathrooms. We just have to see. So we have a lot to do today. I don't know that Mike is going to be at work very long. He's going to pick Bruno up from Montessori at noon. Come pick me up and then we're going to take off and hopefully get our errands done. Who knows with the post office though. You know what will happen there. So, I guess we're driving. Okay, guys. Well, thanks so much for watching. Let me know what you think of Claire. I think it's really cute. I like it a lot. And uh, it's in, in, like, brand new condition. So, I'll link Karen's eBay below. I did ask her what her YouTube channel was. She may not have a channel, um, but I never heard back. But I'll link her eBay and my eBay below as per usual and um was there anything else oh juno had an addison's crisis on the weekend we ended up taking her in and i would had given her her um <clears throat> her percort and her cortisol shot a few days too late and then mike cut back on her prednisone and put her into an addison's crisis so we have to be more vigilant and I have to remember to give it to her on time because sometimes I forget. I have it written on the calendar but sometimes I think I have to give Juno a shot tonight and then forget. So, oh and somebody had told me to stir up my color tattoo to kind of revitalize it and it did work. I didn't stir it up completely but it's definitely more like it used to be. So, Thank you for sending me that little tip. I appreciate it. It worked. And um, while I have a little more time, I just about hit pan on Nooner. Let me put my glasses on to see if I actually did. Nope, but I'm getting very close. So strange. I've hit pan on and Nooner right here is very close. Uh, and then this one I still haven't glued in. Or dark, dark side is the one that needs to be re-glued. And I haven't done it. So, anyway. I'm just doing my crafting. And um, I uploaded a video. Ooh, almost time. Uh, of all the goodies that Sujay sent me. So check that out if you're interested. And thanks so much for watching. And uh, just leave your comments below. Okay, bye-bye. Oh, and I also wanted to say, I'm trying to keep up with everyone's videos and with my comments. I'm finding it more and more difficult the closer uh, we are to moving. Um, so, but I am really trying. Sometimes they're in my feed, but I don't get to them in time and then they're gone. And 
yeah so I apologize if I haven't seen your video or haven't made a left a comment I'm trying to keep up with everyone's videos but um, time is a little short right now so okay well thanks again for watching guys I'll talk to you soon bye